Okay, hello. I'm going to stream Ten Hands of Bridge, play Ten Hands of Bridge, and comment. This should be helpful for people looking to improve their fundamentals, learning the game, uh, and or just trying to see what other people are doing. Uh, this, if you're at this level, and I'm talking about below intermediate level, uh, this is a good book to read. So I highly recommend it. Eddie Cantor is a pretty good bridge player, from my understanding. I am at a table, uh, and we are in a three-diamond bid, so let me jump in, get back to the game, and see what partner's doing. So far, this looks pretty good. We had, uh, partner had a pretty strong, um, pretty strong hand, and... Uh, West made a very unusual bid of two no trump and um, explaining it was kind of a weak overcall. Uh, I doubled since I had points for support for partner. Partner, he spit three clubs, partner rebid the diamonds, and I left it at diamonds, myself having only eight or so high card points. So between us, I think we have about, we have our, our partnership has about 24 high card points. Uh, you can see it looks like we're well on our way to making the three diamonds here. And uh, there goes a queen, okay. And maybe just barely, <laughs> but we are making it, so that is, that's good, I guess. We'll see how many imps we get. Uh, it's a wash, okay. Uh, so on hand two, we lost imps because we uh, there was possibility of actually making a four-heart contract. So let's move on to the first hand. I've got a whopper here, looks like. Nine and 13 and maybe even 15 high card points with a six-card heart suit and a four-card diamond suit. Uh, opposite of one, no trump open. Well, that's very interesting. So if that's 15 to 17, and I've got 15, we've got 30 of the total 40 possible points on the board. I'm definitely going to bid my hearts. Uh, six of them to the ace, king, queen just can't be ignored. Get into this round of bidding and see how it goes. Here we have two three passes all the way around to my two hearts. Okay, so this ought to be interesting. There we go. Partner has two, three, four total points. So yeehaw. <laughs> I see I see some losers here, though uh there's definitely some possibilities with the king and the queen. That maybe I could take advantage of, though I'm not quite sure how I might do that. I have zero transportation over to the board. So unless they lead clubs, I don't think I will be able to access them. Um, how many tricks do I see otherwise? Well... Hmm, let's see. Let's keep that jack on the board in case it comes in handy. And we will, we now have good clubs. Uh, let's see. Well, here's one possibility. Let's see if we can get over to the clubs by losing some diamonds. A little bit risky, I think. But it seems like it's worth a try. Uh, the king of spades is still out there. And here it comes. And I had, what, six to start with, so seven total. And, hmm, one, two, three. Uh, the jack is good. 
Let's see if it goes around. And it does. Okay. Uh, and let's try our luck with one more. And that did not work. Uh, that is three spades played. And it looks like we are making our contract. I will claim this. Wow. Hair on my chinny chin chin. So I got that contract by getting over to dummy and getting one more trick off a of dummy. And we have ourselves another wash so far in points. Although it seems like that's because we're the only one playing these hands. Ah, oh, five, six high card points. We will pass. As I always like to say in these videos, for those at the beginner level, um, uh, whatever, I'm sorry, I was just reading the comments. What I always like to say for those uh, in these uh, videos, for those at the beginner level, the conversation we're having here with bidding is more about the points between our partnership, the combined points in our partnership, than it is about the suits that we have. So we are trying to describe our hands to each other, and we're trying to figure out what the total number of points we have between us is. Um, the total number of points between us will determine how high the bidding can go, and generally, very naturally, the bidding will describe what the layout of our hand, what kind of suits they have, and what uh, length they are. Uh, not obviously, there's going to be a lot of I don't know how do you say uh, give or take. There's going to be it's not going to be very exact, but with conventions, we get more and more exact. And standard American yellow card uh, gives us a pretty good starting point for determining this stuff. All right, I'm going to cover my partner's lead. So we have three no trump, and partner has led a club. Uh, five of clubs, so, and we just took the king and the jack off of the board. Keep that in mind if I get a chance to, if I get the lead back, I'll throw our partner back a club, even though that queen is still up on the board. Partner may have the ace. Or I may be taking the queen off the board uh, and setting up low tricks. We'll see. Possibly unlikely. I'm going to I'm gonna get rid of a few clubs and see if partner keeps track of them. Uh, that's two rounds of diamonds played. And that's ten diamonds played. Eleven... 12, 13 diamonds played, or at least 13 diamonds I can see. The nine's the last one on the board. So I can get my mouse to work here. I'm going to, hmm, I'm, I, um, I'm going to let partner, if partner doesn't have the ace, then, I don't really know. You know, I had the ace of clubs, and I don't know how much I can help help him. So anyway, let's throw all the clubs away and keep our hearts and keep our spades. Okay. So partner is out of spades. <coughs> And I will have to throw the jack here, since East knows exactly what I have. No, 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 I'm not able to play games. My queen is now good. And my king is now good. So... Hmm, partner maybe has the queen of hearts? No. The jack? Oh my god, the ten is good. Oh boy. 
Well, I can't throw around to the 10. Well, maybe I maybe it would have been better. I don't know. And there's that ace of clubs, it looks like. Yep. All right. Three no trump made, plus one. Um, partner might have under leading the ace. It's generally not a good idea for opening leads. And it looks like we uh, got point two in, so a few other people played it. Uh, most of them made what we made. Some of them made a little less. So pretty much as expected. If we look at double dummy here, we see the worst leads were spades and uh, diamonds for partner. So, all right, we have a one uh, nine high card points and an opening one diamond bid by partner. Let's bid that four or better card major those hearts. Uh, let's see, what do we do now? Nine and distribution, 10, 11, 12 uh, total points and one heck of a heart suit. We're looking like we've got 10 between us. Well, so to invite with three or go right to game with four, I'm going to say let's go right to game with four and risk it. It's a little bit pushy. But it might work. So 10, there's only three hearts out there. Uh, definitely got, um, I mean, my part kind of counting on partner having diamond control. Uh, looks like I'm playing this. So I see, hmm, I see. Well, well, I see some club losers here, but I see some spade winners. Let us pull the three trump remaining off of the board. One. See how bad that distribution is. That's pretty bad. Two. And let's get the last one. And right now, I'm inclined to work on these clubs. See if maybe they will throw the ace of spades. There goes the king. Here comes mine, and let's set up. Two. Yep, and we have to lose. What am I saying? We have to lose the spade, but we will make our four. Presumably, if not five, I assume. Somebody didn't hold on to that ace. Well, they did. Okay. And we get an extra trick. Thank you, opponents. Okay. And we got ourselves an imp for that. All right. Our lucky day. Yeah. If, if it's getting down to the end, you see everybody else made four hearts. So I'm glad we went ahead and bid that four instead of messing around. <clears throat> it was that close. And those extra hearts really, really, really helped. And counting on uh, partners control diamonds really helped as well. What have I got here? Seven high card points and a one club open. Well, that's five diamonds. It's nice, but your standard CC response is going to be one no trump. It's basically just calling out a 6 to 10 minimum point hand. And really what you're looking at is balanced distribution. That is a no-trump hand. 
Well, partner, if partner has a long suit, partner will bid it. Or partner will let me play in no trump. Well, no trump can be a bit challenging. But very often nice. Partner bids two hearts. So partner is rebidding. Partner's done a reverse. Partner is showing a fair amount of points. Uh, new suit. We could pass this, but partner should only have four hearts, so we can't leave them with six. That would be insane. Let's show them our other long suit then. Let's go ahead and give them some information about our hands. Our hand. So partner should have 16, 17, 18 high card points for that kind of reverse. Uh, a reverse meaning bidding a lower suit and then a higher suit. 16 and 7 uh, is, is getting up there. Partner has, uh, partner's happy to hear about my uh, diamond stopper. And partner appears to be promising stoppers and other suits. Um, yeah. So we have a problem here with spades. I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight tricks off the top. Uh, where, where does this go? Okay. Uh, and we definitely have trouble with spades. The king is out there. Ten could be good, but that depends on where the king is. Now the ten is good. So there's nine tricks. So we have made our contract. And we might even win an extra club trick. Uh, since we might uh, win an extra club trick, let's throw away a diamond, right? And we that's one. Two, three, four. I was not watching. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, six. I should have counted those hearts. Maybe that seven's good. That's 11, 12, 13. Yep, extra club trick. Not unexpected. And I'm sure somebody will be holding on to that king of diamonds. There's the queen. Saw the double. Oh, now the nine's good. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. Well, uh, East is, I must admit, uh, leaving a little bit for their partner to be desired, even after the original compliments there. Look at us. Three no trump plus two. Yes, we are the only ones that found the no trump contract. We will leave it at that. So very good bidding by partner. So what did partner have in that last hand? Partner had, uh, what do we got, 10? And 16, 17, 18 high card points. Uh, part, partner did, was not afraid of the spades, but having two suits not stopped is a problem. When I bid the diamonds, that allowed partner to go to spades. We got a little lucky with the spades, but <clears throat> we could afford to lose four spade tricks. Um, could have easily have lost five. So that was a bit of a gamble, but it did pay off. Two clubs, okay. Two clubs is a uh, strong, very strong bid for those of you that don't know. 21, 22 plus high card points. Uh, typically, two diamonds waiting. Uh, just uh, often means less than four points, but just means... Okay, what do you want to do now? Uh, West has 21, 22 high plus high card points, so goes to two no trump. Mm, I'm going to pass. I don't have much to add to this. I have, what, six, seven, eight, nine, ten high card points. 22 and 10 is 32. There's only eight 
points between the other two, east and south. Uh, seems like east is willing to bid up to three no trump, so two, through three points probably. So maybe there's a few points in my partner's hand. This is going to be very difficult to play. Only two points in north and east. Okay. Well, we might. A difficult one. Yes, a difficult one. Absolutely. You might well have left them at two, two no trump. Partners two no trump was, uh, you know, not a, not a horribly strong second bid after two clubs. We'll see. We might get him down one. That would that would be a shame for East and West. Quite a maybe a bit of a coup for us. Let's see how this goes. All righty, my partner comes up with only an ace. Um, I am going to let that king go. The reason I'm going to let that king go, there's one more spade, by the way. So that's four, five spades played. I am going to, so that was three diamonds, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Two more diamonds in the west. I don't want, and the king and the queen have been played, so the ace and the jack are good. There's one more diamond. Yeah, I don't think west is going to have any trouble Getting over to that queen. But. Hmm. I don't think that spade means anything. I'm going to throw a heart. So I think we're going to lose that extra diamond check. I might have held on to the ace. Yeah, here it comes. Over to the queen. No problem. Cash in the diamond. Yeah. Yeah, probably would have been smarter to hold on to the um, ace because he could have got to the queen once, but he wouldn't have gone to the queen twice. So it would have cost him an extra trick. Of course, I could well have just lost the diamond anyway. Lost and not not ever been able to cash it in. Okay, I think that means my jack is good. But hmm. Oh, there's a trick. And there's another trick. Oh boy. Yeah. I think I made a mistake there. Yeah, I do. I think I made a mistake. They got 6.3 imps. See there? Look at there. Down one, down two. Yeah, I definitely, they played it well. I played it poorly. I needed to hold on to that ace. And apparently I needed not to lead a spade or something yeah look at that oh boy that well, was okay to lead a spade we should have put taken him down too yeah yeah there was a there was a good example of um of not 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 understanding what i needed to do yeah went ahead him by one trick um, let's see, one no trump, and I didn't have, don't have any five card suits, and I don't have any points. I have four points. So I'm going to need to pass that one no trump. Yeah, that one, that one trick, well, we should have set him two. I don't know why we didn't set him two, but we at least should have set him one.
Yeah, I can't imagine bidding, uh, leading an opening lead of a club. Anyway, uh, partner gets to play one no trump. Partner has 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 high card points. And it looks like good control of all the suits. Uh, there's a diamond trick. I see then two diamond tricks, if not three. So one, two, three diamond tricks at least. Uh, four, five with the spades, six with the hearts. So we do need to find another another trick, and I don't think this was the way to do it. No, no, I, I would have expected West to possibly have the king there, and we're about to find out that is true. Yeah. So I think it would have been more sensible to start working on those clubs. Possibly the hearts. Let's see, maybe West, maybe partner wants West to do a lead. See, now the club is good. I mean, now we can get, we can work the king and the, the queen and the jack. We can work the ace and the king out without any trouble. So, and there's an extra trick right there. So that's two, three, four, five, six, seven tricks I see now. Let's go back and obsess over this last hand. Eh, a couple people made the three, three no trump, but generally. Uh, good defense should have should have set that. And here's partner wisely making his seven tricks while he can. Jack of Hearts is out. There's the king and the queen is nowhere to be seen. It's all right. We made our contract. Okay, not much to say here, just let it play itself out. And it's a wash, so we, so we seem to have made the expected number of points there. A few people trapped West into something a little better, or West got a little over aggressive in some of the other bits. All right, so that's your standard, well, no Trump open without anything to respond to. I've got uh, six high card points, maybe seven. I've got a singleton jack. Singleton jacks aren't generally worth very much. You figure they're going to fall somewhere to the ace or the king or the queen. And one diamond, one spade. I don't have anything to add to this. No preemptive bids. No, no opening bids. So we will just let this hand play out and watch our defense. East is rebidding diamonds. Six or more diamonds. Does not have spades. Oh, best. West has rebid clubs. Looks like there may be two strong hands here, east and west. And surely enough, after that uh, second bid, uh, he says jumped right up into three, no trump. Okay. Let's see how this goes. They bid uh, everything but hearts, right? 
Yeah. Uh, South has uh, chosen not to lead a heart and uh, has gone around to spades. So that's interesting. I don't know. Well, there's no, no obvious strength from partners. Seven, eight, nine, ten spades have been played. Three more spades in the south, and none of them are good. So, tell me. All right. Looks like I get a king here. Uh, or south gets a diamond trick, which is distinctly possible. There you go. Nicely done. Well, I suppose you could lead into those three good spades, but no, now we're getting a heart lead. Alrighty. Uh, we throw our highest there. Let everybody know how high we have it. Oh, there's that ace. That was quite interesting. Uh, could handle could handle another heart here, partner. Ish, yeah. Well, let's see where that ten is. Yeah, we don't know where that ten is. We know it's good. Hmm. Guess we'll find out. Um. Yeah, there's a 10, unfortunately. And one more good heart over there in the east, which is probably going to be thrown off. On a spade, yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I can see why South... Um, I had a lot of good spades, or a lot of spades, and you generally want to lead from your longest suit. Um, I think you might want to lead from an unbid suit first in a no-trump contract. So that would have shown the hearts. Uh, what have I got here? 9, 10, 12, and I got a six-card club suit. Well, let's give that one no-trump bid a little bit of trouble. See how this goes. 12 is not 12 is not a great hand 12 points 12 high card points is not a great hand that's enough to it's enough to jump in we're not vulnerable uh, East has invited to two no Trump uh, invitation declined so East should have about eight high card points I've got 12 uh, 15 to 17 35 five points left for south uh f yeah even less actually oh very nice very nice pick up that queen very nice so uh looks like uh, partner's two points has made a score partner might have more than two points maybe partner's got another queen let's see all right that's that is danger for West because uh, eight clubs have been played. And when I, if I win the lead again, which I just did, I am going to draw four more tricks. So two and four is going to make six. They will be down at least one. Uh, partner showing a discard preference of spades. That might be helpful. And let's see if South did indeed have a preference of spades. 
Another queen. I love it. Uh, going over to that heart. Yeah, too bad. And um, two good diamonds, it looks like. Left. Yep. Over there. So, so it goes. And we got them set by one, and we got ourselves eight, eight imps for that. So revenge for hand number eight. Okay, this is good. Uh, we will play one more hand. So far, so good, and I've got myself quite a hand here. Seventeen high card points, and two major suits. Oh, very nice. Possibilities. Uh, we would bid. Let's see what West if West opens. And West passes. We will bid our five card major at the one level. No need to get too excited yet. Leave room for possible exploration. No bid by East. See what we get from south. South has given us a minimum response. We will go to the three level, showing 16 or 17 points, asking for 9 or 10 from partner, even possibly as low as 8. Yeah, okay. Looks like we, we should get at least eight or nine, if not ten points from south. We'll see. Maybe even total points. I've got 17 high card points. Um, 18, 19 total points. I might have done a mistake by inviting to game. I might have actually just gone ahead and gone to four hearts. That probably would have made more sense. That way we'd be sure not to drop it. Uh, six, seven, eight high card points from partner. Very nice. What do we want to get rid of here? Looks like we want to get rid of clubs. Well, we will get rid of our clubs. Uh, okay, so the queen's still out there. Let us try to finesse the king of diamonds. And uh, okay, that might have been bad. Uh, King of Spades, excuse me, lucky finesse there. And let's cross over with a heart. Let's see if we can throw away a club loser. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's three more. Three more out there. Um, okay, let's see if we can pick up a heart. And let's do our thing with the diamonds again. Still three more out there. Hmm. A little bit tough in the play here. Oh, two more out there. And I think the, uh, is that heart good or not? Oh, it might be. I don't actually remember. Now there's the queen. All right, we made our 10. Lucky us. I think that heart was good. Yes, well, obviously the heart was good. I know the heart was good. Uh, two more. Trump out there. No. Well, I'm, I'm not counting at all. One more Trump out there? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Four spades plus one. So, like I said, once um, spades was supported, it would have made much more sense to go into um into right up to four spades let's see one two see that six and i'm going to sign off for now and uh 
we're, and I'm going to sign off for now. Maybe I'll start another stream. Thank you all for watching. As usual, may your hands be, so, uh, hands be strong and your suits be long.